So I will tell you the basics of how to use the markers from Amsterdam. And the first thing is uh, just shake it. You have to start shaking it so you can hear the metal balls. And when you hear them, then you're ready to go. So you open the cap. And once you open the cap, you can see that the nip is still clean. So it means there's no ink in there. To get inked in the nip, you got to pump it like this. You got to push it pretty good. And then you can already see the ink coming. You can see it so right now. The ink is in there, you can see it. And you can start painting with it. That's why I use the markers. The small ones for using the thin lines, just like this. And once you've finished drawing, you gotta make sure that there's not too much ink in the nib anymore. I'll show you in a minute. And you close it, you close it with the cap again, and you save it horizontally. I'll, I'll explain it with the big markers. The big markers right here, you can see this is a good example. This one went good, still pretty okay. So when you finished painting with the, with the marker, you gotta finish and make sure that there's not, not too much ink in the nib anymore. So you make sure like this, and then you close it and you store it. Because if you don't do that, it will end up like this. You can see it. This one had too much ink in it, and you can see it's kinda dirty after using it. So make sure you'll remove all the ink. And most important part, make sure you have fun with the markers and you can use them with all the other products.